Next tape. Tom and Jerry's Greatest Chases. This the classic cartoons ever made. Here's the spine and the back. Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Mouse is a classic. Tyler Black has a better copy too. Ink label and the print date is February 8th, 2000. for Tom and Jerry's greatest chases. Next tape, All Dogs Go to Heaven, Don Bluth movie. This is a classic movie indeed. Part of MGM Family Entertainment series. Spine and the back. My copy, Ink Label, and the print date is December 24th, 1999. No, it does not have no MGM 75 years promo. Right before the 1998 MGM Family Entertainment promo at Beginning It All. There you go for All Dogs Go to Heaven. Next tape, The Swan Princess. Richard Rich directed it along with The Fox and the Hound and The Black Cauldron. Turner Family Showcase. Here's the spine and the back. Four stars. Parents will enjoy or adore it. My copy. Sticker label and now printed on this tape. Already uploaded the opening to this on YouTube. The clamshell's in terrible condition. There you go for the Swan Princess. Don't ask me to say about it. Next tape. Mary Poppins. 1964 film. It's a live action movie. There's the spine. And the back. Let's take a look at that camera and tripod sticker. Yep, this is a 1988 VHS. My copy. The sticker label's from 1987. The day and year code is the 286th day of 1988. Yep, this is an early pressing. It has some brochures. We're not going to show. There you go for Mary Poppins. Next tape. Herbie Goes to Monte Carlo. This is the sequel to The Love Bug. There's the spine and the back. This film came out in 1977 along with The Many Adventures of Winnie the Pooh, The Rescuers, and Peach Dragon, and Close Encounters of the Third Kind, and Star Wars Episode IV, A New Hope, and Raggedy Ann and Andy, A Musical Adventure. My copy, ink label, and the print date is August 10th, 1997. I will upload the opening up to Herbie Goes to Monte Carlo as soon as I can in the future. There you go for that. Next tape, The Aristocats. This is a 1970 Disney animated film. It was the first Disney animated feature Produced after Walt Disney's death because Disney died in 1966. The film's from 1970. Yeah, Walt Disney did not supervise this film. Here's the spine. And the back bursting at the seams with rib tickling fun state by Entertainment Today. My copy. Ink label and the print date is... February 20th, 1996, and February 17th, 1994. It's kind of odd to be a mixed up print date. It's a 1996 VHS. There you go for the Aristocats. Don't ask me to say about it. Next tape Rookie of the Year. This is a classic movie, part of 20th Century Fox Family Feature series. Two thumbs up to Cisco and Ebert. 
here's the spine and the back. I already upload the opening to this on my YouTube channel. If you want to see it, it's on my YouTube channel. Vertical sticker label. There's a weaking air code. 31st week of 1994. You better stay tuned for part one. Part two will be next. Is Next up is the 2000 Gold Classic Collection VHS of the Fox and the Hound. Part of the Disney Gold Classic Collection series. Here's the spine and the back. Same crit review as on the 94 Black Diamond Classics VHS. My copy. Dark sticker label. The print date is April 6, 2000. This will be the last Disney animated classic to use the end, as well as the last one to use the Buena Vista logo. There you go for the Fox and the Hound. You better stay tuned for part one. Part two will be the will be next. Stick around for that, won't you? See you all in part 